and Curtis for Election Day. It was pretty nice, so nobody can blame the weather for not voting. Yeah, and, and a windy one, though, making it feel a little cooler. But overall, I mean, we've had freezing rain. We've had snow on this state, so a dry day across the state, and that's good news. A little bit of sunshine now, and again, temperature is 38 degrees. But when you factor in those winds, expect wind chills as you head out in the upper 20s. But dry for uh, heading out this evening hour. Those winds will stay west at about 10 to 20 miles an hour. Clouds are going to give way to clearing skies. Later tonight, it's going to be a chilly one out there. Most locations dropping down below freezing. These low clouds kind of hung around, especially Metro Northeast. It cleared out a bit more down in southwestern Iowa. Look to the north. This is all snow in North Dakota. Fargo over towards Moorhead and then snow north of the Twin Cities up around Brainerd. Rain, Wisconsin, a system down south. We are watching our own system. Should be dry tomorrow. But a system winds out of the Rockies. Clouds will increase in front of this on Thursday. And I think we could have some rain changing over to some snow Thursday night. So here we go, hour by hour, clearing out overnight. It looks like we'll have some sunshine tomorrow. I think the clouds will hang around north and east with this cold air flowing in. Now watch what happens Wednesday night, Thursday morning. Here comes the clouds. The snow slowly pushes on in by Thursday evening could affect the evening commute, especially west of the metro, and then the system kind of winds out before another system possibly drops in on Friday. Let's look at the first batch of snow, and again, folks, this is a ways away, so we may have to update this forecast, but it looks like the first batch, maybe an inch down south. Again, some of this will melt on contact less than an inch of the metro, because your sophisticated viewers, I'll show you what the second batch could do. And again, we'll have to update this, but you can see a little heavier snow in northern Iowa. All this based on the temperature out there, but potentially some accumulating snows later in the week. 28 degrees out there, clearing skies, cold temperatures with those winds. Still a little breezy tomorrow, but mainly sunny skies at high up to 41. Keep in mind, the average high 50 three degrees snow chance on Thursday, mainly late after sunset Friday could be a couple waves, some wind too. And then look at the cold day on Saturday, starting out at 15 high 33 40s Sunday and then cold weather next week. Matter of fact, next Tuesday may not get out of the 20s.